Well, looks like we got our very first find. Got some porphyry right there. Let's grab it. It's cold. <laughs> got some great feldspar crystals in there. I'm gonna toss it in the bag and I'll tell you where we're at. So I am up on the north shore of Lake Superior and I'm at a river that I was recently at and I had really great success just hunting the banks. But today I have my waders on. I have my big view tube, the upgraded version, Darth Tubius, and we are gonna see what is in these waters in this beautiful river. So let's keep going. Oh gosh, I almost fell over. We got a really pretty piece of prenite right there. Right there. We'll grab it. That's really nice. Really great light green betroidal. I'm definitely gonna bring that one home. That's sweet. So I found our very first agate. <laughs> it's so little. It's so cute. And then I don't know what that is. I can't quite get my my bucket in there. It's kinda hard to tell. I'm sure it's nothing, but I'm going to try to dig it out. It's kind of stuck in the river. Oh. Golly, that's stuck. Feels really porous. Let's check it again. Hard to say kind of interesting. I'll work on it a little bit if I get it out. I'll show you. Well, we got it out. It was a waste of time. It looked good initially, <laughs> but we got our agate and then I actually found another one on the bank. So we got two on the bucks, two little agates. So the first view tube that I made was really, really small. It's like half the size of this thing. And this one is really, really nice. It's really helpful. And I'm gonna show you why I love using this thing and how it helps me see things that are unseen. So this is one of the spots I wanted to look at with my YouTube because there's no way you can see anything in here until you use the YouTube. And right down in there, if I can get this to work, right in the center, I think that might be a thing. It's gonna be a tough one to get. Probably gonna get my sleeve wet, but it looks like it has potential. <sighs> Can't even reach it. Can't even reach it. Kick it up if we can. The one day I don't bring my little tool for scooping stuff out. What a struggle bus, my goodness. There it is. It's probably not even gonna be anything. Okay, okay. It's got some agate goodness in there, just really, really light. But overall, low quality, but we're finding stuff, and that's what matters. So I have been finding a couple of really interesting things. And this one right here, it's really, really waxy. It's got some quartz on top. And the feeling of it reminds me of an agate, but there's no bands. It's probably like a red shirt. Pretty cool. This little guy, look at the details on this. Beautiful Jasper, so pretty. And then this guy, I thought was pretty cool. It's got these little agate pockets in there. Where's the good one? Right there. So cool. So I'm gonna be bringing these two <laughs> I'm going to be bringing these two home with me and having a lot of fun. Kind of looking in a lot of spots that I wasn't able to get to the first time I came here. So, <sighs> my back hurts though <laughs> from bending over with this thing so much. But 
I have a feeling one of these times we're going to find a really nice piece. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that, but that looks like an egg. <laughs> Bucket here. Oh. oh man. Oh, for sure. I'm trying to get this thing to focus. It's a funky agate, but that's an agate for sure. Look at all the details in that. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. I've been finding a few. A little, a little further over there not the highest quality but this is funky i'm just happy we found one of decent size oh that's sweet and right below the waterfall <laughs> sweet let's see what else we can find in these murky waters i just got this little guy out of there as well i didn't think it was a negative at first but absolutely oh that's like pure flat at one point that was up against some crystals. That's cool. Oh, I just spotted another one. This is definitely the best one of the day. Where are you? Right there. <laughs> Woo oh yeah. <laughs> oh, sweet. Whoa. <laughs> oh yeah. What a beautiful nodule. Oh, sweet. Look at that window. That is so cool. Limonite staining. Some water level banding in there. That is awesome. This is a good spot. Right over there, I found a really cool water level and amethyst take the last time. So this has definitely been the little treasure trove so far. So one of the disadvantages that I've had on this agate hunt is the lack of sunshine. I feel like that really would have helped me see some of these river gems glow a little bit, but either way, I had a ton of fun. I'm definitely gonna be coming back here with the YouTube and the waiters again. It was a blast. There's a lot, a lot of spots that I haven't even touched yet. So thank you all so much for joining me on this really fun agate hunting adventure. I'm glad I was able to get back to this spot so quickly. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, leave a thumbs up. We'll see you next time. Bye.